Hello, hello. Welcome back to part three of the Persona 3 Reload series. I'm going to continue off now. Alright, I think... We just had the Persona Awakening, so now... See, what am I doing? Uh, oh, okay. We have to head up to the command room. Ah, there you are. Looks like you've recovered. I'm glad to see that. There are some things I need to discuss with you. That's why I asked you to see me so soon after your discharge from the hospital. Uh, please, have a seat. Oh, before that. I believe I mentioned his name before, but this is Sanada-kun. Hey there. Okay, let me start off by asking you this. Would you believe me if I said that a day consists of more than 24 hours? I wouldn't believe it. That's a reasonable reaction. However, you've already experienced this truth firsthand. Do you remember the night you first arrived here? You had to have noticed the signs. Street lights going out, things that stopped working, the inexplicable appearance of coffins. With so many things amiss, didn't it feel like you'd stepped into a different time? That's the dark hour. A time period hidden between one day and the next. Uh, I don't get it. I know how you feel. Who would believe such a fantastical claim? But the dark hour does exist, and it occurs each night as the clock strikes 12. It will happen tonight, and every night to come. Normal people don't realize it, since they're all sleeping inside their coffins. But that's not what makes the Dark Hour so interesting. You saw them. Those creatures. We call them shadows. They only appear during the Dark Hour, and attack anyone who roams free outside the coffins. It's our job to defeat them. Pretty exciting, huh? Akihiko, why are you always like this? You just got hurt the other day. Now, now, he does his work well, in any case. I'll get to the point. We are the Specialized Extracurricular Execution Squad. C's, for short. The Specialized Extracurricular Execution Squad. C's for shorts. All right. On paper, we're classified as a school club. But in reality, this group is dedicated to defeating the Shadows. Bruh, this, this must be the most dangerous school club ever. Mitsuru Kirijokun is the leader, and I'm the club advisor. A shadow feeds on the mind of its prey. The victim becomes a living corpse. Apathy syndrome. I'm sure you've heard of it. We sometimes refer to those who suffer from this as the lost. They're responsible for most of the incidents on the news, if not all of them. Although rare, there are those who can function during the Dark Hour. Some may even awaken to a power that enables them to fight shadows. That's known as Persona, the power you called upon the other night. Persona. Shadows can only be defeated by Persona users. That means you are the only ones who stand a chance against them. Um... <laughs> I see. I'm glad you're quick to understand. What he's trying to say is, we want you to join us. We've prepared an evoker for you. We'd like you to lend us your strength. 
Damn, you're giving me a gun already? No permits? Uh, I'm not sure I'm ready. Don't think too hard on it. Just hang out with us for a while. Please, we need your help. Wait, don't pressure him like that. What if he feels like he can't say no? I mean, I'd like it if he joined too, but... Uh, I guess we don't have a much of a choice now, do we? Okay. Um... Eh, I don't mind. Does that mean you accept? Oh, I was afraid you wouldn't do it. I'm glad to hear you're on board. We really appreciate it. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask. Thank you so much. Truly. Oh, I almost forgot. About your room assignment. Why don't you just stay in the room you have now? I don't know what the holdup is, but I guess it worked out in the end. <laughs> Hold up? But wasn't that... Oh, never mind. Hey. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast established a new bond. Let's go. Seize the day, yes. I feel my inner strength growing. I recall what Igor said about the power of social links. Well, that's all for today. I'll follow up with you regarding our club activities later on. Certain terms that have been displayed before in messages along with their descriptions can be viewed by opening the menu and trying to go going to some stuff okay. I apologize for gathering you all here on your precious day off. Tomorrow is Sunday, so take some time to relax. Well then, shall we end this meeting? You know, <laughs> because it's Me? the weekend. Shall we Everyone end? Looking at like... Shall we end? Get it? Haha. <laughs> you been oh my god Michael Jackson <laughs> oh no it's just this guy uh, let's just say we we accept that he's in here who who are you we've met before soon the end will come I remembered so I thought I should tell you Really? Well, if you say so. To be honest, I don't have much to tell you anyway. More importantly, it looks like you've awakened to your power. And what an unusual power it is. A power that takes many forms, yet is bound by none. It might even prove to be your salvation, depending on where you end up. Do you remember when we first met? I expect you to honor your commitment. I'm always watching you, even if you forget about me. Okay then, see you later. You are. Could you come downstairs? Sonata Senpai's calling for us. Okay, he's here. So, what's this about? Ooh, the casual outfits. Thanks for coming. There's someone I want to introduce. Hey, 
Hurry up. Just a sec. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Junpei? Why are you here? Junpei? Don't tell me. This is Junpei Yori from Class 2F. I'll be staying here from now on. <laughs> What's up? He's staying here? Are you sure there wasn't some mistake? I bumped into him the other night. He has the potential, but he just awakened to it recently. I told him about us, and he agreed to help out. Really? You have the potential? He found me crying like a baby at the convenience store. Surrounded by a bunch of comments. I don't remember much, but man, that's embarrassing. But he said that's, you know, completely normal in the beginning. Like being confused and not remembering anything. You guys know that? <laughs> Did, didn't happen to me? <laughs> hey, what's with the top guy act? <laughs> you should know about it, since you're a Persona user and all. But man, I still can't believe it. I had no idea you guys had this stuff going on, too. <laughs> I had no idea you guys had this stuff going on, too. I'm glad I'm not the only one. Wouldn't really want to be doing this on my own. You gotta be stoked too, right? Having me join? Having me join? What? Uh, I guess. Well, enough with the introductions. Now that our forces have increased, I think we're about ready. Ooh, we gotta go do something? Sweetness! I'm getting pumped! With this many people, we could start checking out that tower. <gasps> tower? Oh, you mean Tartarus. Oh, the stuff you put on the fish, right? Tartar sauce? What? <laughs> <laughs> it's a place that holds the key to understanding the Dark Hour. Or so we think. The key. Huh. The chairman will give us more details tomorrow night, so be ready. It's 420. when you get back to the dorm tonight. I have something to tell you all. Oh, are we having that talk already? I'll save the details for later. See you then. Damn. Doesn't waste any time. She's not like us. She's busy, you know? With the student council or whatever. Oh, Yucatan, do I sense some hostility? It's not that I don't like her, it's just... I don't know. Hmm, you say I don't know. I don't know. You okay? School day's finally over. They're probably waiting for us at the dorm, right? Let's hurry back. Didn't delay our train so much. It's already dark out. It's been happening a lot lately, though. People jumping onto the tracks. This apathy syndrome thing's getting out of control. It's like the whole world's falling apart. Crap! Everyone else is there already. We better hurry. Oh man. 
getting kind of hungry. It's small rocks. So many places to chow down. Plus, they're open late. Speaking of, I heard the ramen joint upstairs has a secret late night menu. We better hear the door. All right, everyone's here. Heck yeah! Let's get right into it. Now, I'd like your undivided attention. For a long time, Kirijo-kun and Sanada-kun were the only Persona users we had. But that number has recently jumped to five. So here's the plan. Starting tonight at 12 a.m., I'd like us to finally begin exploring Tartarus. Uh, so, I asked this yesterday, but what is that Tartar thing again? It's Tartarus. You seriously haven't seen it, Junpei? Uh, I mean... It's no surprise you haven't seen it. Tartarus only appears during the dark hour, after all. Only during the dark hour? Just like the shadows. Interesting, huh? The goal of our club, Seas, is to fight those shadows. However, simply defeating shadows during the dark hour isn't enough. We must get to the root of the problem. We need to destroy the dark hour itself. Uh, I don't really get it. Well, you're saying if we run around Tartarus, we can somehow get rid of the dark hour? We don't know for certain. Sorry I can't give you a better answer. But investigating the mysteries of that tower is part of our job. The bottom line is, we need more information. Everything we encounter there will be a vital clue for us. The exploration of Tartarus is of utmost importance. Consider it our top priority. Our society, while remaining blissfully unaware of the shadows, is slowly but surely succumbing to their influence. I would go as far as to say that the fate of the world rests on the shoulders of you Persona users. That's one hell of a responsibility. But the heroes of justice will prevail! It's also the perfect spot for us to train and improve our skills. That place is like a nest of shadows, you know. Whoa. They're nest, huh? But Senpai, what about your injury? Akihiko's still recovering from his wounds. He'll accompany us, but won't participate in the exploration. <sighs> yeah, I know. Oh, Junpei's got your backs. I'm not so sure about this. What about you, Mr. Chairman? I'll stay here. Not much point, anyway, since I can't summon a persona. Huh? We're here? Uh, what's going on? Why are we at school? <laughs> uh, wh what's going on? Why are we at school? Just wait and see. It's almost midnight. This is Tartarus, the labyrinth that reveals itself during the dark hour. Labyrinth? What are you talking about? What happened to our school? 
Once the dark hour passes, everything will return to normal. This is the nest you were talking about? But why? Why did our school turn into a giant tower? <sighs> you don't know either? No. I'm sure it's complicated. If we don't know, we'll just have to find out. Mitsuru and I have only gone in to take a peek. This will be our first time exploring it. Exciting, huh? There's gotta be something in there. Hopefully some sort of clue about the dark hour. Akihiko, I respect your enthusiasm, but you won't be exploring it today. I know. You don't have to keep reminding me. Wow, this looks amazing. Wow. It's just as crazy on the inside. Sure is creepy, though. This is only the entrance. The labyrinth lies beyond the doorway at the top of these stairs. First, you need to get a feel for the place. Why don't the three of you go have a look around? What? By ourselves? We're not asking you to go very far. I'll help you navigate by feeding you information from here. We'll also need to appoint a leader to make any necessary decisions. A leader? Like... The captain of a pirate ship? I'm in! Me, me, me! Pick me! <sighs> you're in charge. <laughs> Vegetables, you're in charge. Wait! Why him? He doesn't look like a captain! <laughs> Calm down. He has experience fighting already. Wait, seriously? That's true too, but the main reason is far more simple. Junpei. And you too, Takeba. Can either of you summon your persona without difficulty like he can? Yeah, of course I can. Me too. These are shadows we're talking about. Without your persona, you're screwed. I'm aware of that. All right, let's head inside. Are you ready, leader? That's the spirit. What's the matter? Yo, that door looks crisp. I've been waiting for you. The time has come for you to wield your power. The tower that you are about to venture into, how did it come to be? For what purpose does it exist? Regrettably, you are not yet capable of answering these questions. That is why you must be made aware of something before you go any further. You must understand the nature of your power. E yeah, about that door. The door you just passed through is the entrance to this realm. Of course, no one but you can see it. Your power is unique. It is like the number zero. Empty. But at the same time, holding infinite possibilities. You, my boy, are able to possess multiple personas and summon them at will. And when you have defeated your enemies, you will see the faces of possibility before you. There may be times when they are difficult to grasp, but do not fear. Seize what you have earned. Your power will grow accordingly. Be sure to keep that in mind. Now then, my spare time will soon be scarce. Next time, once again, May you open the door and come here of your own accord. I'll tell you then about my true role. The manner in which I can best assist you. Until we meet again. 
farewell. So we meet again. Farewell. Hey, are you all right? Yeah, what's up? You look like a zombie. Bro, these people are probably like, man, this guy's our leader, and he's like, not even, um, he's not even mentally here. Like, god dang it. Dang it. <laughs> yo, yo, I opened this door in. <laughs> huh? What door? Man, are you loco? Have you been nodding off? You seem kind of out of it. Dude! You're supposed to be our leader. Get your head in the game. Man, this guy is asking the real questions here. <laughs> like, no cap. We'll be following you. Come on, let's go. Leader. You can save at locations where you can change your party. However, you cannot save on the floor you're currently exploring. Okay. Save from the menu or pressing the options button. I was just um, getting a feel for the area, you know, running my laps. All right. So, it's the real deal from here on, huh? Looks easy to get lost in. Can you all hear me? Whoa! Is that you, Senpai? I'll be providing audio backup from here on out. Keep that in mind. Wait, are you saying you can see this place from all the way out there? It's my persona's ability. The structure of Tartarus actually changes from day to day. I'd like to join you up there, but we need someone to provide outside support. That's even more concerning. Now, based on your current location, you can expect to encounter enemies at any time. This shouldn't be too tough, but proceed with caution. You'll get the hang of it as you go. Right. Got it. Why is she always like that? Right. Let's begin. Defeat all the shadows on that floor. I'll support you as much as I can, but it's up to you to learn something out there. Oh, we about to get some some real battles up in here now. Man, that's so cool. Oh, it's so cool. They even still kept this like uh corner like staircase thing <laughs> like when you're exploring the area in like the OG. Hold on. There's a shadow up ahead. This is the first real battle for Takeba and Iori. Proceed with caution. Yes. All right. Let's start by going over how to attack shadows. When faced with an enemy, you have two primary options for fending them off. The first option is to use your equipped weapon. The second option is to use your persona. But remember, 
Every persona has its own strengths and weaknesses. Knowing how personas work will be crucial. Try summoning yours right now. All night, right here, shadow turn a cloud direction. Seize the moment they destroy the nation. Round slow motion, give me motivation. Break out now, head on the ride. Round the around, spin out to death. Ooh, yo, that's clean. That's clean. Oh, yeah. How'd you like my persona ability? Yeah, yeah, that was amazing. Well done, Iori. Considering it was your first battle, you did well. Talk about two. You'll be fine. Don't be afraid to show what you can do. Got it. Good. Let's continue exploring. I wonder if I could change them to uh, direct commands yet? I guess not. Okay. I think I just have to keep progressing. Another shadow up ahead. Let's get you more accustomed to combat. The battle's about to begin. Everyone, stay focused. Next, let's go over a useful approach for defeating enemies. Most enemies have an elemental affinity that they have low resistance to. Targeting weaknesses is one of the best ways to deal damage. Not only that, it can also knock enemies down. Knocking down an enemy creates an opening, letting you continue your offense. Weaknesses, huh? Done. I'll show you how it's done. Wait! Let me handle this one. Just point it to my head and pull the trigger. I can do this! Oh, you're not so bad yourself, Yukitan! That's it, Takaba. You give it a try as well. Yeah, yeah, I, I know how this goes now. Uh, let's see this one. I know Rose is a little different, so we go back to other one though. Uh, if you use this extra turn to knock down a different enemy, you can attack one more time again. Yeah, okay, okay. It's the same thing. I'll go with. Never mind. Well done. You struck the enemy's weakness. Keep that up and finish off the rest. I'll go with. Oh, I did it! Fantastic work, Takeba. You performed as well as I hoped you would. Totally. I can take my eyes off you. Can you try not being a creep? Great. Looks like everyone's gotten used to handling their personas. Leader, take note of each member's strengths and conduct the battle accordingly. I can still sense some enemies around. Let's move on. Yeah. The 
back. Eh? Yes, boxes like those seem to be scattered all throughout Tartarus. Sometimes they contain useful items for battle. Seek them out as often as you can. Oh, sweet! So they're basically like treasure chests. Hell yeah! Let's bust it open and see what's inside. So the special items look like the the suitcases. So let's go. That looks like it'll be useful. It's up to you to decide how to use it. Okay, so auto recovery is R1 this time. Royal was square. Okay, uh, yeah. Nice. Shadow detected. Looks like they haven't noticed you yet. Now's your chance. Try sneaking up on them from behind. Make sure you stay out of their field of vision. Soda. This is our tent. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Shuffle time. Nice. Hey, nice. Oh, if you end it with an all out attack, it'll always occur. Okay, nice. How 
how'd you like our all-out combo attack, you filthy shadows? When I saw my opening, it's like my body just knew what to do. That was magnificent teamwork. It's hard to believe it's your first time. As you grasp the flow of battle, you'll learn to coordinate with each other seamlessly. Let's apply what we've learned so far and continue exploring. Another shadow up ahead. Take advantage of what you just learned. Try not to alert the enemy as you move. Wow, the animation for this shot is so cool. Oh, oh shit! <laughs> That was actually a lot shorter range than I thought. Making decisions based on the situation at hand. I'll continue providing support, but this time, go ahead and try fighting on your own. You, my boy, are able to possess multiple personas and summon them at will. This is it. Your persona just now. It looks like you really do have a special power. What to do? This is our ten. Let's wipe them out. Gotta get the EXP up. The enemy has been defeated. Excellent work. Um, was that? Well, it looks like he has the ability to summon different personas. I suspected as much after the events from the other day, but now we know for sure. Your chest looks different from the one before. Yes, that particular box is sealed in a special way. The box can be unlocked by its own mechanism, but it needs something else to work during the dark hour. What's that you got there? Really want to explore now. The 
Looks like you found a teleporter. Now use it to return to the entrance. Welcome back. So, how was it? No problem. I see. Well, if you gained confidence, that's the best thing you could have achieved. Wow! I never knew I had that kind of power! But damn! Why do I feel so exhausted? Because you were bouncing around like a little kid. You say that, but you look pretty tired yourself, Yukatan. This is different. It's like I'm having trouble breathing. What's going on? That's the effect of the dark hour. You'll become fatigued more easily. Don't worry, you'll get used to it. I have to say, though, I'm surprised. You all did much better than I expected. At this rate, they'll catch up to you in no time, Akihiko. <laughs> we'll see about that. Not bad. Salut. <laughs> what do you want? <laughs> Sorry. That concludes the main portion of today's assembly. Next, we'll hear a word from the student council. Please welcome the new president, Mitsuru Kirijo, from Class 3D. Thank you. So she did get elected. Well, I guess she is the most popular girl in school. You can say that again. She's got this intimidating vibe around her. Not to mention, this school's owned by the Kirijo group, right? Ah, so she paid to win now, did she? As I begin my term as student council president, I'd like to share with you my vision for this coming year. It is my firm belief that each of us must accept the responsibility of bettering our school. However, change cannot occur without sustained effort and an unprecedented level of commitment. That is why we must restructure our daily lives in order to rise to this challenge. I'd like each of you to dig deeply into your well of motivation and reevaluate your convictions. Strive to imagine a bold new future without losing sight of the realities around you. That is the key. My own ideas are but one person's vision. For us to reap the full benefits of our education, your participation, opinions, and enthusiasm are essential. Thank you. 
Hey, what a speech. Do you, uh, have any idea what she just said? <laughs> um, so sort of. Sure didn't sound like something a high schooler would say. If it was anyone else, we'd be laughing our asses off. Polonia Mall on the way back? Might want to stock up while we can, since we got stuff going on at night. There's a pharmacy there, too. Couldn't hurt to get some meds in case anything happens. You bet I am. If we don't step up to the plate, who will? The chairman said it himself. The fate of the world depends on us. Man, this, love, this guy loves to be a considerate hero now, huh? Let's go, leader. First task, escape from the school. Sonata-san is with the ladies? Man, take a look at that. I guess neither of us really got to know him before all this crazy stuff happened. He's a captain of the boxing team. Never lost a single match. I know that's cool and all, but who'd have thought boxing would turn you into a chick man? I mean, come on! They're fawning on him more than a harem monk. I wonder where they're going. Hey, are you guys free this afternoon? Huh? Uh, us? Yeah, I mean, hell yeah! We love to join your little, uh, group here. But what about the fate of the world? <laughs> ah, don't be lame. Even heroes need some rest now and then, you know? Well, are you free or not? Yeah, of course. No problemo. I want the two of you to meet me at Polonia Mall. You know where it is, right? I'll be waiting at the police station. Got it? J the police station? J j j j j the police station? <laughs> you mean we're not hanging out with your friends? Who? These girls? No, I don't even know their names. Hearing so much chit chat gives me a headache. Anyway, I'm going on ahead. Don't keep me waiting. Can he not know their names? I mean, seriously, just look at them. Man, how could he not know their names? Uh, anyway, let's go. Who, these chicks? I don't even know their names. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna start. I'm gonna stop this part here and I'm gonna continue on another part in just a second. <laughs> 